Hey guys, welcome back to the channel, Captain Bailey's Adventures. We've got the first mate here in the background, and we got the Blue Point Brewing Company Toasted Lager. Now it's an American style amber. Okay, but it's a lager. So it's not an amber ale, it's a lager. Amber Lager by Blue Point Brewing Company, 5.5% ABV. Let's give it a crack and see, shall we? We've got all these uh, brown ales going here. So now let's try the brown uh, lager. Ooh. Now it's a lager, but I just got some nutty notes there. So it smells more like an ale. And there you go. Now that's that nutty, caramely color you're looking for when it comes to something that's called amber, right? Cheers, mate. Yeah, it has that nut brown ale, caramel bitterness thing going there. <sighs> Smells more like an English ale compared to a lager, American lager. I guess it's the hops. Cheers. Yeah, it tastes like a nut brown ale to me. It has that caramely, caramel notes there, fruitiness on the back at, back notes. A little metallicness there on the tongue. Also, that nuttiness that you normally associate with a, a brown ale whatever it is it's either the, the toasted malts as it's specifically says on the bottle toasted lager so you got some toasted malted barley here or something going on in their mash but yeah it, it, i'm you know i'm not schooled on the different types of beers like a nut brown ale it's called nut brown ale, so I'm assuming it's an ale. So it's brewed with an ale yeast, not a lager yeast. This says it's a lager, so obviously the yeast they used. So say, for instance, I guess maybe they did the same recipe as making a nut brown ale, but they used a lager yeast. Hey, when you're brewing, you can do whatever you want, right? There's no written rule. That's why you keep coming up with these brewers and these new craft breweries who keep coming out with these different things. They'll take a, you know, you think of a stout and a porter and now you got a the black, por black lager. So it tastes exactly like a porter or a stout, but it's made with lager yeast. So it's, it's got a weird crispy finish to it, you know? So there's th different things like that. Like people are experimenting with, you know, where they'll do like a, you know, a regular ale, and they'll throw a bunch of Cascade and IPA type hops, so it gives it those citrus fruits, juice, fr juicy fruit flavors. So it's like you think you're having an IPA, but you're really just having, I don't know, a regular ale or a, or a pale ale. But when you add all these different things that you associate with an IPA into that, you know, so I digress. So cheers, guys. Oh, crisp, refreshing. Hey, I guess, I don't know what you want to call this style. I mean, it's a lager, so it's a toasted American style amber, American style amber lager. Is that a style? I mean, you amber ale, not a amber lager, but hey, whatever. What does the captain know? Uh, scale one to ten. Seven out of ten. We'll say seven. Whatever. Hey, check it out for yourself. Let me know in the comments if you have had the Blue Point Breweries Toasted Lager. Let me know. Cheers, guys. Until we do it again, let's set sail.